today, after revisioning the campaign, we take a bold step forward. Today, we are as a state family. We will realize the promise and deliver the future through the public launch of our campaign. Our promise, a promise to serve the campus community in new and profound ways. Our future, a future that will be built through a major commitment from the state family, a commitment that will mark a historic era of giving and support. Today, we publicly announce our goal to support the West Virginia State University, our students, our programs, our facilities, giving them support that will not stop until we reach. Are you ready for the goal? Yes. Are you ready? Yes. Drum roll. Zero. Zero. With me. Zero. 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 Eighteen. Eighteen million dollars. That will be our campaign goal. We will raise this over the next three years, and I'm confident in the state family that we will be able to achieve this. Go state! Go state! Go state! The students are our future, so we need to remember that. So anything, if we look back to any successful person and any business person, we have to take a look at getting involved, being a participant in their lives because many of those students and many students across the country didn't maybe have the upbringing that we were fortunate to have. So this is where I think the business community needs to get behind students and all of us taking a part in making sure that we allow these students to succeed. It makes a big difference and uh, gave opportunities for people here that wouldn't have had them otherwise. Mm -hmm. And I think it's given opportunities in the future for people that uh, wouldn't have them otherwise. And I think building up uh, foundation monies and scholarships and things is a needed thing for these people. And if we're going to get these people uh, have long-term futures and stay in West Virginia, we need these. Uh, uh, we need them to be able to afford to go to college. If you look at the alumni association, it's mostly people 50 or older, and They've been doing it for years and years and years. My age group, anywhere between 35, 35, 45, 50, maybe homecoming, maybe a $100 donation a year, but we're really not involved as we should be. So maybe if I lead the way and they see this donation, they think, oh, he did it. Well, let me put some money together and do it for myself, do it for my city, for Cincinnati or, or D.C. Or, or Houston or wherever and say, on behalf of their chapter, make a donation, or on behalf of their practice or, or their business, make a donation. So maybe it will open up the door to future donations of people from my generation.